Hi guys, my name is Ella and and this is National Engineering Week. So today we will be making a new mag machine. It's fun and easy to make. It it's a machine that helps you understand how air pressure can move things like my little cat Snowy here. Uh will even send you the parts. Now that we got all our materials out, we can get started with this. First, we're going to make two triangles out of the popsicle sticks. So the thing you do is you put one end of the popsicle sticks on the straw and the other end. Same one and repeat throughout. each of the straws so it can make a triangle like so but you take the tape wrap it around where the stick meets and just make sure it's all stuck to that so it doesn't pop out and repeat with the other straws. Now that those triangles are finally done, we can put them together using popsicle sticks and tape. There, and wrap around, do that, and over. Make sure that at least two of the triangles are on the same side because you'll need that to put the pneumatic system on it. When you have this, you'll need to tape it to the other triangle using more tape. Using the same technique, just keep putting it on, and eventually it'll look awesome. If you follow the steps correctly. If you don't, it's going to look like a bunch of stuff taped together, but it still might look awesome. Oops. So, this is what we have for now, but we need to add the part that moves snowy up. So next, you'll need a big stick to have an area where you can put your pneumatic machine. Um, so you just take tape and tape it onto it, onto both of these sticks that are there for holding the thing. So you just one corner to the other and wrap it around randomly till it's secure. And there we go. So then we'll need to add a hinge system like this. So next, the tip of the syringe in each side of these tubes it doesn't need to be in far, just enough that when air goes no. through it, it will not come off. But on one, it needs to be extended and full of air, but the other one needs to be empty. And connect this to here. Take the little straw to one of the little straws at the end, make sure, and you take the other straw and do the same to this one. Remember, not too, too close, but not too much room. 
and then we will take our pipe cleaner and cut it. Loop it through one, fold it, and loop it through the other, and twist to secure it. So then I wrap the thing around multiple times. Uh, the pipe cleaner around the syringe multiple times. And then put it under the thing, I mean under the um, popsicle stick and Wrap around that and wrap the pipe cleaner around that too. You want to tape this using tape. Um, so you take some tape. See if it works. Ooh, it works. So now that we've built our machine, uh, I want to explain how the pneumatic system works. So I have the pneumatic system by itself to explain it. So when I push down on the syringe, it creates a high air pressure compared to this side, which has a relatively lower air pressure. To equalize the air pressure, it moves the gas over to this syringe, and it works in reverse. So when I pull on this one, it creates a low air pressure, and this one has a relatively high air pressure. So again, to equalize the pressure, it moves this, retracting the plunger. And when we're using this to make our pneumatic machines, we're using just a simple lever technique to raise and lower anything. It's really fun to play around with this simple machine for a variety of uses.